the sword of heaven and earth welcome back to this rom hack of fire emblem 7 by 38 percent last time we defeated the nomadic rival mergen today it looks like we're about to go fight no loki who is this guy who's been kind of being nefarious throughout most of the game and I looked at this map, dude, and I had an idea for something because, I'll be honest, oops. Dude, Murdoch is here? He's like, where did you take my armor? <laughs> it's like, this guy's a splice of me. Is it a commentary on morphs? Or morphs a commentary on splices? Regardless. Let's see. Oh, it's this dude. Dude, they all have the same armor. It's super funny. I mean, I guess it fits, right? Like... They're all on the same team. So... Okay, so while this, while this is happening, we're setting up for a warp skip here. This chapter looks like it was built for the warp skip. So you can see here, there's a ton of dudes. I don't want to fight the, the Lack Dragos again. I don't even care what's on the chest. What I do care about is that I don't want to fight him. Because look at his stats, man. They're insane. And then Loki is much more reasonable. So, my plan, and I have another army that would spawn over here, but we're just going to do this. We should be able to, if we play our cards right, dude, we should be able to three turn the map. Because I gave auto warp. The thing is, though, so I did a little bit of testing. I kind of need to rig a hit with Gim. So you're going to see me do some rigging because I can't be... I can't be bothered to play the map. I hope you understand my feelings on this matter. Alright, so... Yeah, because they don't even move, dude. This chapter is just like, hey, you want to warp skip? Hey, you want to warp skip? <laughs> I'm like, yes. <laughs> I'm interested in the warp skip. So Gim has a hammer. And then... Oh, no. Dagnabbit. I've been utterly owned, dude. Alright, so maybe... We, uh... Take Karen instead. Because Karen has a restore staff. <laughs> now we'll show them... It's getting absolutely bodied by the hack right now. Oh, wait. Dude, I'm getting bodied again by my poor movement. Uh, whatever, we don't... Uh, yes, I do want him. Guys. I haven't had my coffee yet. And I'm trying to... This is so not me. I don't warp skip. I very rarely try to warp skip chapters. But I looked at this one and I was like, eh, it's not happening, dude. I mean, I guess I could probably position myself so that... Ooh, that's not gonna happen. I think I'm just gonna have to deal with it and try and eat it. It's fine. But this is why we liquidated all of our assets. To get the... get rid of the silence. To get our restore staff.
Alright. So it doesn't go for him this time. Kind of strange. Maybe he has like wait and turn AI or something. Alright, so if we do this. Otto with the big level up. Okay, so now I have to hit two 55s, but it's doable. That's one. No. All right. Let's see, does this help? Wait, also, I wonder. No, it's not gonna happen. So it's gotta be hammer. No. Okay. We might be here for a while. I don't know how to burn our ends, dude. Am I doing it wrong? Little arrow wiggle. Or am I just not getting good RNs here? Woohoo, we did it, dude. He cap speed, what a lad. Alright, so now let's. Oh, ho, dude. <laughs> I feel very smart. Guys, we're ramping up for endgame now. We're warp skipping chapters. This is Fire Emblem. Nothing says a late game Fire Emblem like I'd rather not play the map. Now we meet Sauce too. I... I... Kind of wish I could have gotten stuff in the chest, but whatever. So... I wonder how that would have been if I tried playing it straight. But I don't really feel like I should be grinding. I don't really want to grind. I also don't want to fight Gilling. And break all my good killer weapons. I think we get Sauce now, which might be nice. Dude, Sagan is here. Thank God. I do love... Hey, it's Roy. This is giving me, like, Thracia vibes when Selif shows up. And he's like, hey, I'm doing an adventure. Leaf. Is this just like, it's sort of Heaven and Earth, just the Thracia to Fire Emblem 6? It kind of is, in a way. It's like if Fire Emblem 7 is the, uh, the fan fiction, this is the Thracia. That's pretty cool. Side quest? I feel obliged to. Well, that was chapter 24 in less than 10 minutes, so I apologize that that was so short. But we got a guide in now. We'll see how that goes. I'm going to take a look at the guide and. Let's actually, let's take a look at the guide. Uh, do I want to play this guide in? I'm not sure if I want to play this guide in. Alright, let's try it. Let's see. Now if we go to chapter 25. Let 
This looks like it's Dino and Peptide. Dude, Peptide's back and Enuo is back as well. This map looks... Hmm. I'll, I'll have a think on this to decide what I want to do next. I'm not going to do it right now. We'll do... <gasps> Alright. I feel like I should try 24x, but... I'm really interested in finishing the hack, so... We'll see. I mean, Gim's already capped, so I have, I have no reason to even try. I should just warp Gim in. Again. But... Okay. All right, guys, that's going to do it. That was chapter 24. I will see you next time for either 24x or 25. I'll see how I feel. I'll look in Builder probably and make a judgment call if it's worth going to 24x or not. But until next time, everyone, be safe. And this was the Sword of Heaven and Earth by 38%. See you later.